Welcome to part 5 of Time to Play Yoshi's Island for SNES. And now we are starting in the World 3. Welcome to Monkey World. Oh man. There'll be a lot of monkeying around. Is Donkey Kong meets Mario? I don't know. Wait, but this already happened. <laughs> Duh. Anyway. Alright, back to this awesome music again. All these monkeys, though, if I remember correctly, they're pretty annoying. I think I mentioned this in part four, I don't remember, but, um, I know there's two secret levels in each world. That's when you score perfect, when you get a hundred in every level. Unfortunately, I would not be doing that in this OP, because honestly, I don't care to do it. But, I did, when I was, uh, when I was a teenager and I first played this game, I did do it in the first two worlds. World 3, I could not quite do it, so I kind of gave up on it, but, uh, yeah, fortunately, you would not be seeing that in this LP, but, of course, you can look for it on YouTube somewhere. Uh, I'm not the Wii guy, I can't be perfect in every LP, uh, um. Oh, this muddy landscape here. This game is dirty. Yeah, I'm smashing all these pulls, yeah, to get the red coin. Even though I'm not gonna do my best to get you know, 100 points in every level, I still want to get what I can. I guess just make the gameplay more interesting? I don't know. Oh, there it is. Pwned. Oh, nice. I'd rather use my eggs, though, than the freaking watermelons, honestly. The pockets are real comfortable with it, more used to it. It's probably the most friendliest game ever created next to Yoshi's Story. Yoshi's story is to where it makes you sick. Oh, well, that makes me sick right there. I just died. I fell. All right, it's quick cut to here again. Ah! There we go. Oh, that was stupid. I guess I'll jump through him. Oh. I'll come back here. There we go. It's a nice, colorful world here. Nice looking island. What this? Oh, the, we're in Yoshi's Island. Nice part of the island. All right. No bonus stage. Move on to the next level. Oh man, freaking Indian level or something. I forgot. Jungle rhythm. Dot dot dot. Hmm. Oh, nice. Uh, the same music again. That's pretty cool. Whoa. Man, watch out. Shut your Indian in the cupboard looking. Kill the fake Kirby's here. Pwn. Oh, 
What the heck? Oh, that's right. Oh, shoot. I got speared by Goldberg. That was a failed joke. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of uh, of pauses in the sound to turn this video probably because <laughs> right, lots of failures coming up to where you hear Baby Mario cry. Well, of course, I edited it out because as I said, and I think in part three or four, I'm going to edit out Baby Mario crying because that's pretty annoying. What the heck? Okay. Yeah, this dog right here. This is the first time we've seen this dog in this game. I don't know. I haven't done this LP in a while. And as you guys know, this is another Ocarina Time esque LP. It's probably going to take me three years to finish. Not that it's a long game like Ocarina Time, but I just haven't been doing videos and felt like it or been too busy. So that's why Part 5 took a while to come out. So I don't even remember what I said or done in part four because it's been a good while. Oh, come on. There we go. Ah! I fail! Oh, I fail again. Come on, I just want to get the flower. Oh, there we go. Yeah, of course you can't eat a freaking shy guy who has a Indian mask and a shield and spear. Nice. Whoa, not nice. Dang it. Oh, I still got it. ECW. I still got it. Oh, not anymore. I don't got Baby Mario. Now I do again. Yes. Missed one flower, but oh well. Oh, barely missed the bonus stage. Or not barely missed it. Barely got the bonus stage. 65, that's still failing. I give it 65 of 100. <laughs> Alright, match cards. Would you be still, Yoshi? You look like a freaking douche marching in place. Alright. So I gotta remember here. No game of memorization. Remember that. I remember that. Full house. Full fail. Okay, I get one more chance. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> uh, all right, now. 3-3. Three, three. Oh, yes, I remember this level. I forgot what it's called, though. Nip and Nuts Domain? What? Yeah, I do remember this. This is where you gotta find that blue monster that comes out of the water or something. We got his domain. Oh, look out. Ah! No, no! There we go. <laughs> At least I got the flower. That thing really is scary. Oh! Come on. Yes. Oh, no. Ran out of eggs. Dang, what the heck? How'd you get over there so fast? Oh, it's back over here again. Now 
nice. Yeah, come on, game. Meet me halfway. Wait, that was a fail. That's not a halfway point. Just a... Uh, save point, whatever. Reminds me of, uh, was it Sonic 2? I think those lampposts or whatever you hit. That's like halfway through the level. That's what I was thinking of. But anyway. Ah! Alright, hurry up. A uh, door. Uh, more Indians. I don't got anything against Indians, but I do in this game because they're my enemies. Oh, wait, whoa, you can eat them from behind. That's because they're not. They have a shield on their back. All right, nice. You know, look at this toy helicopter. Now I feel like I'm playing Little Nemo the Dream Master as I get to morph into different things. I, as you can tell, I did a quick cut right there because I failed a lot right here. Ah! Come on! No, man, I failed again. Try this again, hopefully we'll succeed. Come on, nice. Yes. All right, now I get to morph to a submarine. Get down there, you idiot! MCW. Oh no! Ah! No! Reminds me of Mega Man 3 where you're using the Rush Marine. That's pretty cool. Oh man, no, come on. Come on, hurry, hurry. No. Oh no, I gotta go all the way freaking back. Jeez. Oh yeah, that's right. You can shoot torpedoes. Duh, I forgot. Awesome. Now what? What? Look at those, yeah, those freaking crackhead fish from Mario 3. Or as Venom 22 called them, ADD fish. Ah, fail. Come on, come on, you're almost there. Yes. Oh, what? What, you feeling froggy? Jump. Oh, that was nice. Come on. Jeez, freaking mud. Oh, look out. What the heck is that? It's Claw Grip from Mario Brothers 2. Kill it. Oh, whoa. Oh, jeez. There's two of them. What? Jeez. Come on. Nice. So many frogs and idiots in this world. All right. Dang it.
dang it, come on, go down the Castlevania stairs. Down, there you go. It's not really that hard, I don't know why I'm making it so hard. Probably because I suck. Ah, oh, what? Come here, you idiot. Ah! Jeez, come on, knock, knock it off. There we go. Finally done with this freaking level, jeez. No, let's move on. Alright, the final level for this video. The mini castle with the mini boss. Level 3-4. Prince Froggy's Fort. Great, of course. You see a lot of frogs in this world, you're gonna fight a frog as the boss. Oh shoot. Oh nice. I do love this track though. Oh no, there's the freaking evil emo not emo. Evil flowers. I wish some uh somebody make a ROM hack of this game to where you can instead of those angry flower faces be like troll faces. That's <laughs> coming after you because jeez, those those flowers really troll you. They make you think that the the smiley flowers that you can collect, and they're not. Pretty cool way to trick you, though. It's pretty cool. Ah, oh. this is not cool right here. There it is. Uh, no, that's not cool. Oh shoot! Three seconds. Oh jeez. Well, I thought that was the sea. Now it's starting to make me think it's, it was the evil flower. I mean, it wasn't. So you gotta really look closely and be quick. Oh, see? Man. I tell you, Yoshi's. I know he's not the parent of Mario. Uh, you know, the father of Mario, but geez, these Yoshi's, they can't. They're not good at babysitting or something. I mean, those little to toadies that try to take baby Mario away, it's probably, it's probably really CPS. <laughs> you can't re you keep freaking losing the baby. Go! I like the details in the game. Look at the water. I guess that's the light ray of light shining. Where's the light coming from though. It's no it's sunset. This thing. This thing's gonna cause me to fail. That's right, I blame my failures and other things. Jeez. Come here. Alright, nice. Nice. Uh oh. 
Haha, <laughs> you missed. What? Freaking rip off a claw grip. Claw, claw grip. What's it, what's it? Claw clip? Craw clip? <laughs> Come on. Yeah, you want some what? Oh, oh, that was close. Get the flower. No, I want to get the flower. Dang it. Ah. All right. Oh, well, that was a failed way to get the flower. I got the flower, all right. Come on. There we go. Ooh, nice catch. Ooh, and ooh, another nice catch. Oh, man, ECW. Jeez, how long is this castle? Oh, uh, yeah, how's it feel? How's it, ah, dang it. I was about to say, how's it feel when someone swallows you? Oh, there's the evil flower again. All right, finally, boss time. Come on, you feeling froggy? Let's go. Okay, so my guess is we're going to fight a giant frog here. All right, and what Wait, what the heck? Why am I being painted? What the heck? Whoa. What the heck just happened? Whoa, I'm inside of the frog. So I gotta fight that punching bag, whatever the heck it is. That's pretty cool. See, they should have done this with some of the Bible games where Jonah, uh, and the whale swallows Jonah, and then you have to fight enemies inside the whale to get out. I guess kind of like in Jabu Jabu's belly from Ocarina of Time. They're probably better than some of the corny, stupid stuff they did in most of those Bible games. But at the same time, would be it would not be biblically uh, biblically accurate, like super Noah's Ark 3D, where you freaking shoot the animals with slingshots. But anyway, all right, this is kind of cool hitting this thing. Boom! That's it. Nice. Alright, ECW. The first half of World 3 is clear. So, that is the end of this video. I will see you guys in part 6 for the second half of World 3. Until then, God bless and take care.